in Oakland, several families affected by yesterday's fire that you saw here breaking on KPIX 5 spent the day cleaning up. The vegetation fire quickly spread from the roadway, Highway 580 near 35th and MacArthur Avenues up to the homes there. Eventually, it turned into a four alarm fire and damaged five homes. Some of the families tonight are having to stay in a hotel because of the mess. They tell KPIX 5's Da Lin this was a fire that could have been prevented and they cite a second fire that happened at the same location in two years as the reason why. Granite top, brand new cupboards, everything was remodeled seven years ago. Joanna Roberts' one bedroom cottage right gone. Her two there. tenants who lived there survived, but lost a cat and everything else. The front house where Joanna lives has minor fire damage. This is more than just shelter. This is memories. This is my grandfather, Walter Dice. Her grandfather built grandfather. the main home and the back cottage in 1921. Ty next door asked me if I was going to rebuild. I said, I don't know. With everything being so expensive right now, is it feasible with me being 74 years old to do that? I don't know when my number is going to be called. Like Joanna, other homeowners are assessing the damage and figuring out where they'll stay for the next few months. The fire on Friday damaged at least five homes. A few of those burned to the ground. So this used to be the man cave and this was the barn doors right here. The fire destroyed Alex Gilmet's in-law unit. There's going to come a point in time where I will cry about that. But it hasn't hit me yet because there's still stuff to do. Since there weren't enough firefighters in the first few minutes of the fire, he says he turned from a homeowner to a volunteer firefighter. I'm giving you the hose. Knock down this fire if you can use this hose. So I'm grabbing that hose here and I'm dragging it as far as I can, literally standing here in these crocs and trying to use that hose to knock down the fire on that building. Once more firefighters arrived, they took over and saved his main home. I can't, can't breathe because I didn't have a mask on at that moment. So now it's hard to breathe. It's hard to see. Neighbors say this is the second time since October of 2020 for a fire to break out in the same area. Investigators believe a small homeless encampment next to the 580 freeway and 35th Avenue started the fire two years ago. Even though firefighters are still investigating the new fire, neighbors suspect the same cause. And so it's frustrating because since the last fire, um, nothing has been done since. While upset, the survivors say they're glad no one was seriously hurt. That sucks. That sucks. But, you know, nobody died. Again, the fire still under investigation. One firefighter had heat-related injuries and was taken to the hospital. In Oakland, I'm Don Lynn, KPIX 5.